After 13 years at the helm, North Central College football head coach John Thorne has announced that he is stepping down from his position at the end of the 2014 season. The John Thorne era can only be described as wildly successful. More than 110 wins and just around 30 losses gives Thorne the school record for wins. His winning percentage of just less than 800 is good for 11th all-time in Division III football. The decorated coach is stepping down to spend more time with his church and family. Taking his place will be his son, the current offensive coordinator, Jeff Thorne. I've loved football. I'll always love football the whole rest of my uh, life, but I've really loved uh, being part of the Cardinals. And uh, it's North Central College has been a fabulous place. Staying undefeated in football is no easy task. The longer you last, the bigger the target on your back becomes. This week, two Naperville area schools put their undefeated records on the line, but only one came away unscathed. Obanzi hasn't lost yet. The Warriors take their 4-0 record into Glen Bard East. After Zach Benema gives Wabanzi a 28-21 overtime lead, East QB Philip Ambrosino throws this touchdown pass, but then Jack DeFino's extra point is blocked, a shocking end to a 28-27 Warriors win. Bennett also goes into this game undefeated, but the record doesn't last on the road against the Maris team with its back against the wall. Here, Darshawn McCullough makes one of his 13 catches. He finishes with more than 120 yards on the way to a 21-7 defeat of the Red Wings. Glenbard North quarterback Brett Gassiorowski faces some serious pressure from the central defense. Here, the blindside hit forces a hurried throw right to Bobby McMillan. He goes 62 yards for the touchdown, 28-14. Central wins at home. North looking to rebound after two losses at home. Jerron Fields finds Tommy Jackson deep at the end of the half. The cut to the inside, it's beautiful, gives Lake Park a 21-point lead that would never let up. 35-21. Wildcats coming off a breakout game from their offense. This was just the last quarter of the first quarter. Brock Rutter and Isaiah Robertson starting to find chemistry as Nequa breaks its own points record, 69-27. Mattia looking to jump over 500, up by three in the second. Kyle Mooney sees Michael Phillips on the crossing route, and Phillips finds the end zone. The Mustangs go on to win 44-27. On the tennis court, Naperville Central number one singles player Tiffany Chen has been a problem for most of her opposition. And after losing to Chen, Nikwa Valley's Christina Stankovic looks to rebound on the road against Wabanzi's Susanna Rantanen unusually warm fall weather as they take to the court. And back and forth they go, exchanging some powerful forehand shots, but Stankovic proves to be too much. She avenges a previous loss with a 6-love, six 6-1 six win. The Wildcats sweep 7-0 on the road. 